So I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough of our app. Now Charma Pro has been designed to help low income customers who are members of Charma manage their transactions across their group. So the app is loaded, has all Android apps by clicking on the icon. That would take you to a lo secure login screen where the Charma manager enters his mobile number and password, which I'll quickly do. To log in. When you log in, you're taken to the list of current clients. Uh, new members can be created very easily. Uh, we will uh, quickly walk through. Every member is allocated a group. Um, if you have a look, there's uh, the list of groups, so you can select already registered groups. We've only got one currently, but that will do. So let's put myself in here. So I'm Anthony. We will uh, quickly enter that. You, we keep track of their surname and their mobile number. Mobile number is very important because it allows us to uh, send confirmation messages, which we'll see shortly. So let's enter a dummy email address. We have controls in place to make sure that it's a legitimate type of email. We select agenda and then we can take a photo. For the purpose of the demo, we won't do that. When we save, we get the uh, use the GPS to uh, isolate their location. This allows us to find the client later if we uh, have trouble finding them. So once we've created a member, then you can create some transactions. So during the weekly meetings, each member will give their deposit to the group, uh, which can be done simply. So they click on the deposit, you can do a number of actions. You can deposit, you can withdraw, you can charge, or you can look at their history. So we'll make a quick deposit. Perhaps we brought uh, 52 Kenya shillings this week. And as simple as that, we can see the balance change. Uh, if we want to withdraw, it's just as, uh, as easy. Click the withdraw button. Let's this time take out 25. And there we go. History just takes you to a sheet that shows that client's history. So let's go back to the member screen and look at the other tabs. The second tab is the history tab. Clicking this tab shows you all the transactions in reverse chronological order, um, allowing you to see and keep a track or record of which customers uh, did which deposits and making sure that everyone can agree to the balances. The final tab is the cash screen. The cash screen is, is a screen which allows the manager of the program to keep track of the total amount of cash that they've collected since the last visit to the bank and then they can deposit that money in the bank. So this time we see we've got 27 uh, Kenyan shillings which we collected from our customers and we're just going to go to the bank and deposit those 20 to make sure that we clear the balance to zero at the end of the day. And there you go, we can now check the history, we can see that it's all there and that's the demo. So thank you very much.